name is Ash from Enter.net. I am the IT manager, and today we're going to set up Thunderbird. Thunderbird is an email program. So the first thing you'd want to do is open up your web browser. Today I'm going to use Firefox. So once the program's up here, in the top of the address bar, type in www.enter.net. And you'll go to our home page where you'll click on the technical support link. Now once you get to the technical support page, scroll down and under downloads we have a link for Thunderbird. Click on that. And it'll take you to the Thunderbird page. Click on free download. Now, depending on the browser, it might ask you to run or save. Click to run if it does. In Thunderbird, it asks you to save, so click on Save File. And we'll click on the program to open that up. So once you open up that program, it should give you Welcome to Mo Mozilla Thunderbird Setup Wizard. Click on Next to continue. You can leave it on Standard for the installation and use Thunderbird as my default mail application. You can leave that checked and click Next. You can click Install. It will install it in your hard drive. Right. And then once it's finished, you should get this completing the Mozilla Thunderbird setup wizard page. You can leave that check for launch Mozilla Thunderbird now and click finish. All right, and when once that program's opened up, you should get an option for accounts and create a new account. You want to click on where it says email. Once you get that, you should get an option for would you like a new email address. Click on skip this and use my existing email. So for your name, you can put in your full name, last name, whatever you'd like people to see displayed. And then for email address, put in the full email address. for the password, put in the password for your email account. Alright, so you can leave that check to remember the password and at the bottom click on continue. Next you want to click on manual config and it'll give you some server settings. So first thing we want to do here for incoming is choose pop for the server hostname, it's going to be mail.enter.net. The port is going to be 995. The SSL should say SSL TLS. Authentication should say normal password. And for the outgoing server, it's going to be the same as the incoming mail.enter.net. The port is going to be 465, and the SSL will be SSL TLS again, and the authentication will be normal password. Now at the bottom, if you see it looks like it has just the first part of the email address, you're going to want to change that and put in the full email address. So that should change it for the username for incoming and outgoing. Once you have that, Click on Done. Now it'll check the password and you can go to the inbox and if you have any new emails, they'll be displayed right in the center. So that's it. That's how you set up your enter.net or enter mail address using Thunderbird. If you have any questions, you can always go back to our technical support page where we do have the instructions.
Thanks and have a great day.